Hi, it's Rox. Welcome to my channel. Today I wanted to do uh, just a chatty video about uh, my Natasha Denona palettes. I have quite a small collection of Natasha Denona, but I wanted to rank them for you and tell you why. Number five, I have the mini bronze. This one looks like this. I have a video on this on my channel if you want to see. Uh, why it's number five? It's only because I feel like this color story is the less inspiring for me and I feel like these two shades are really similar on the eyes so the looks are gonna be very similar with this palette so yeah that's why it's a color story that doesn't inspire me uh, the most but the quality is really nice. At number five I have uh, the mini Xenon so this is a smoky palette uh, why is it number four? It's because I feel like this palette it's more like companion palette than a standalone palette. Uh, I will use the black and the grays with the other palettes to create a more smoky look. So yeah, the quality is really nice, but it's not a palette that I really use on its own often. Three, it's my only uh, midi size palette, so it's the retro palette. <laughs> this one looks like this she's in my project pan so yeah I really like um, the mauve tones and the pinky tones and everything it's the palette that I'm wearing on my eyes today so but I've I've been a little crazy with liners and uh, and I stick some roses on my face so yeah but this is this palette. I really like the color story. I feel like it's a palette that you can use uh, to work or for a night out. It's a uh, very practical. You have a lot of options like the berries, but the, the pink and a lot of and a little bit of brown and a little bit of oranges. So yeah, it's a very well rounded palette, but I like the quality of the other two palettes a little bit more than this one. Number two, it's my mini glam. So this one looks like it. Um, I have a video on my channel on uh, basically all of these palettes if you want to see. But I really like this color story. Like I really like uh, the cool tones uh, with my eyes. So yeah, I feel like it's favorite mostly because of the cool tones it was something that I really wanted in my collection that I didn't have before and yeah my only critique is that these two shimmers are really similar on the eyes maybe it would have been nice to have a more variety so yeah and I really like the quality of the mattes and this is a great great palette Number one, my favorite Natasha Denona palette, my all-time favorite, it's the Mini Love. So she's looking like this. I feel like the color story is similar to the retro, but I feel like the quality of these five shadows uh, are very, very uh, nice. And some of in the retro palette are less nice, so I feel like at least with this palette you have five solid shadows so yeah it's really worth the price and this one here it's a it's a dual chrome so yeah it's really cool and even though uh, it's a five pen shadows you can do a lot of different looks with this one so this will be it for this video if you like you can give it a thumbs up I would like to know uh, what is your favorite Natasha Denona palette. If you don't have one, uh, what, what, which palette would you like to have in your collection? And yeah, this is it. So um, you can subscribe if you want and I will see you in another video. Bye!